Hello, my name is Chuang Lu, Customer Service Engineer with Textron Aviation. I will demonstrate how to use the Window TCAS diagnostic software for the Honeywell TPU TCAS unit. Download the TCAS diagnostic software from the CessnaSupport.com website. Log in. Select Model 750. Maintenance software. Click More and select TCAS Diagnostic. The following information may be retrieved from the TPU. Input output data. TPU internal diagnostic and log file. Configuration module strap or bearing correction data. Currently track intruder data. Cable calibration data. Current system status. This video will provide instructions on how to install the RS-232 cable and procedure to interrogate the TCAS processor unit. Connect the RS-232 cable to the TCAS RS-232 connector and the other end of the cable to the window laptop or RS-232 adapter. Connect an external power supply to the aircraft and turn on the avionics system on the aircraft. Push the power button on the laptop and wait for the window desktop to appear. Start the program by clicking on the TCAS diagnostic icon on the computer desktop. Once communication are established and the TPU has completed initialization, the TCAS diagnostic main screen appear. The main window consists of a menu bar, a menu, a button bar at the top, and TCAS2 processor specific information at the bottom of the window. Clicking on the current processor input output data, there are two options for inspecting the TPU I.O. data, single snapshot or continuous. The, sing the snapshot view provides a snapshot of the I.O. data and the continuous view requests the continuous update of the I.O. data. Continuous mode is a single snapshot repeated every one to two seconds. Inspecting the TPU internal diagnostic and log data. On the Diag log menu, Click View to request the TPU internal diagnostic and log data. Failures for the current power cycles are not in the diagnostic and log data, since log is written at the end of each power cycle. The configuration module selection will provide the user the view of the strap data. View the bearing data, modify data, modify the strap data, Modifying the bearing table, save to a text file, save to a binary file, copy from a binary file, and initialize the configuration module. The intruder data provides two options for viewing track intruder data, overwrite view and capture view. Click on the viewing cable calibration data the cable calibration are performed periodically by the TPU so that bearing may be computed as accurately as possible. These options allow the user to view the result of the most recent cable calibration and causes the cable calibration to be performed at an accelerated rate. View the current system status. These options allow the user to view the current TPU system status without having to try to read the LED located on the side of the TPU TCAS unit. This data may be viewed two different ways, overwrite or continuously. The status is updated every second or two. All data may be written to a user-specific file by clicking Save from the File menu, the active selected window will be saved. 
This concludes our tutorial of how to utilize the Windows TCAS diagnostic software from Honeywell. If you have any question, please contact Team 10, toll-free number 1-888-622-4789 or 316-517-5650 or email citationx at txtav.com.